Let's take a look at the precious plastic shredder here. So this is the dual shaft one. These shafts here are 45 millimeters, so it's about one and three quarter inch about. Distance between the two shafts is about 140 or close, 140 millimeters or close to six inch. So let's keep stripping this down. Look on the inside. So the gears, I want to take a look at how long this gear is, these metal gears. So let's see if we can 3D print them by beefing them up a bit, making them larger. So these are right now fifty-eight millimeters, about sixty over two inches long. This is a pretty big thing, yeah, over two inches. Um, so quite chunky. We can probably do that in plastic if we make these uh, maybe double herringbone, so there's more contact area and make them larger so talking about instead of two inches more like four inches and possibly on each side so what I might do because the challenge here is okay can we do this using lower cost methods 3d printing is 5000 psi for the structural strength of plastic and uh, I think if we quadruple this and do double herringbone, which is easy to 3D print, we might be able to do this. Um, and put on the other side, put uh, another set of gears like that if these are not going to hold. Because here we're talking about pretty, pretty good forces. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, about 24 blades on each side, so that's that's quite a bit there. And yeah, still the same construction here with these plates. A lot of, a lot of these plates. Now we're looking at doing half inch blades, so do about half the blades compared to here. But these blades are they have more teeth. They've got, um, let's see, let's expose this, take a look at one. I mean, these shafts are significant just to measure that again. Look at it 44 millimeter uh, under two inches, but about one and three quarter inch. Yep, that's about what we need. You look at the individual blades. Uh, they've got quite a bit of teeth. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 or so. Uh, and then what about the opposing teeth? Are they the same? The opposing teeth are actually different. Uh, so there's a bunch of... On one side it's more, more teeth, on the other side it's less teeth here two four six so let's count that again uh, starting at this one one two three wait can't see okay one two three four five six seven eight nine ten thirteen thirteen to six teeth is the ratio and you can take a look at this file you can open it up in FreeCAD uh, import it as a step file but yeah this is pretty good this is quite solid and for us we're gonna do since we want to chip up high larger things like say PVC pipe sections and that could be like six inches I think we're gonna benefit from the larger uh, half inch half inch blades uh, just to be more scalable at this point okay